They're calling it the world's most powerful detachable PC. HP's ZBook X2 is a hybrid tablet with keyboard attachment that is designed to please some of the most demanding users out there, aka creative professionals. For those people who use Adobe apps like Photoshop and Lightroom often, this is tailored to meet those needs. That's why the company is launching it here at Adobe Max and we got to check out a preview unit here in New York. For something that's supposed to be super powerful, this thing is extremely heavy. The tablet alone weighs about three and a half pounds, uh, and the keyboard companion on its own is a pound. So together they weigh about 4.5 pounds, which will most likely break your back. And also it's okay if you want to use it on your desktop for long periods of time, but if you're going to be holding on to it and working with it in one arm, you're not going to last very long. It's built to meet the durability standards of mil-spec A10G so it can survive some falls. Now on the back, there are fans to dissipate heat. It's required because there are some pretty powerful processors in here. We'll get to that in a little bit. On the sides are quite an array of ports. You get two Thunderbolts. You have HDMI as well as USB-A along with some USB-C ports. A bunch of different options here so you don't have to carry around dongles with you. There's also a sturdy kickstand here so you can prop it up on the table at a variety of angles. For people that use Adobe apps a lot, a good screen is really important. So HP went and outfitted this guy with a 14-inch 4K display that goes up to 300 nits bright, which is not really the brightest in the world, but won't scorch your eyeballs. It's also color calibrated to support up to 100% of the Adobe RGB spectrum and supports something called HP Dream Color. You can also turn this into sort of a laptop replacement by attaching the companion keyboard, which also comes in the box. Because it's made to accompany such a big device, there's plenty of room here for full-size keys and even a shortcut row at the right-hand side. Each button had pleasing depth and travel. I really like typing on this thing. It feels just like a real keyboard on a laptop, also thanks in part to that metallic feel on the deck. Also included for the price, which we're going to get to, is a stylus that's more advanced than the ones that HP already makes for the rest of its regular laptop lineup. This HP pen here supports up to 4096 levels of pressure, so you can detect just how hard or soft you're pushing the pen against the screen. Like most digital pens today, there is a button on the side that you can customize for shortcuts. What's unique here is that there is a button at the top that acts as a pressure-sensitive eraser, so you can actually undo what damage you've done just by pushing this on the screen. HP actually teamed up with Wacom to make this digitizer, and it shows. It feels really good, and drawing with it was a very smooth experience. It's also good for you to know this is not a Bluetooth pen, it's EMR, so it draws power from the screen, and it understands how hard you're pushing the pen against the screen because of that technology. So what's behind this most powerful PC? Well, you get 7th generation Core i7 CPUs, and if you attach the keyboard, you'll benefit from the NVIDIA Quadro graphics processor, and there is the M620 model, which should make it faster when you're editing photos on the go. This thing also has a hefty price tag. It starts at $1,749, so it's really targeting the audience that really needs something like this, and that's pretty niche. The good news is though, HP is bundling a 20% discount to Adobe Creative Cloud with each ZBook X2, so maybe that's some savings for you. If you have that kind of money though, and are willing to buy something like that, this does look like it will at least live up to your needs. For more on the latest gadgets, stay tuned to Engadget.com.